Okay. So I don't know where DOSBox is getting this filter from, but we're just going to wing it. It's green sleeves. So if you played the 2015 game, this is the game that Games Chapter 3 is based on. Also, just like the first game, random dumb ways to die. Still can't swim. Fast. Fast. Keep typing in the wrong window.
play that sound. Sound alert's not working. Strange. That was really lag. is working. Wopsy. Dumb ways to die. Jump in the ocean without floaties.
I'll come on and do the thing. Get it. Put that icon on the cave. I can only do that in the first game. So this is the witch in the third chapter of the 2015 game. I know you have to do something here. But basically, it's like one thing. Whereas 2015 game has her role turn into an entire chapter. Also, it's not quite as clear in that game that Agatha is basically blind. Even though she calls Grammy princess. Really, anyone who can see could tell that he wasn't.
not the pizza pop cooled down too much. So the outside got a little tough. I swear the first time I played this, I never tried to get that event because I got rid of her. Oh, I guess you can. I must be thinking of the first game then. Oh well, it doesn't matter. It's wrong, Iggy. I will point out. I've only played this game like twice. And the 
second time, I basically speed ran it for the capture for my other channel. Now we gotta find red. Why was the basket in the mailbox anyway?
almost ran into the water again. Okay, so we have a stake and a silver cross. You know what that means. There must be a vampire. Just casually robbing this guy's place. I was about to say, soup's on. Very, very important. Never cross this bread.
You can only cross it three times. So if you cross it before you have everything you need, you soft lock the game.
let's see, do we have everything? Bracelet check. Ring check. Earrings check. Okay, I think that what we need is llama check. Trident, bracelet, stake, necklace, earrings, mallet. Where's the mallet?
Now this has to be it. Okay, what else? Basically, get everything before you cross the bridge the first time or you will softlock the game. Plus the thing at the other side of the bridge gives you a clue each time, so you have to write it down. If you go back to check again and don't open the door, you failed the game. But also, opening the door moves the main story quest marker. So if you open the door before you have the items, then you might miss something. There is a reason why this game is practically forgotten. It has like the meanest soft lock in the first three games. The third game you can also get soft locked. But that one is about time. So you get soft locked if you take too long. Like if you are a modern player. With all the tutorials and hand holding and leading by the nose. These old games are likely frustrating as heck. They wanted you to buy the hint book. Trust me. Or call the 1900 hint line.
Dad only bought the handbook for Space Quest Hut. Because we got stuck on the mat. The one that you need to wander around in the darkness for. And then we also had one other hint book. So the Space Quest 2 used an invisible ink trick. Where is the other one? We used a red gel to make the text legible. I forget which game that one was for. I think it might have been one of the Larry games. Doesn't matter though. I spent it like $100 on long distance calls to the BBS back in that day and just scraped the entire BBS's hint section, even for games I didn't have. So if I ever needed a hint, I could just search the text file. Come on, Hickory, it was 2400 baud. It took like an hour. Like, relatively speaking, I have a 1.5 gigabit connection now. So that 1.5 billion bits versus 2400 bits.
Let's make sure we have everything. I don't think this point list is in aura. Anyway. We're apparently missing the bro. Unless you can swim Hagatha too late. Look and hole.
This is why AGI is Kindleful. Okay, now we have everything, I think. The inscription reads, Whosoever chooses to seek the key for this door will undoubtedly make a splat. Well, time to cross the bridge again.
You had to have seen that coming. Hundred days in. Hundred days say. It's better down where it's with a under dozen.
Why does that look like a key? You open the door to another door. Read door. The inscription reads, whosoever chooses to seek the key for this door should set their sights high.
Remember when I was talking about genies? Look out, Graham, there is a poison snack. Oh, you all thanked me for that reference later. Well, we could use the sword. Look a Pegasus. Bye bye, bear. Break the fourth wall.
What's funny about this is how many screens they had to add to the game that was on floppy disk to do this bit. The game has like 71 screens. Quit breaking the fourth wall, damn it. Look another door. Read door.
Whosoever chooses to seek the last key must have a stout heart. So at this point, if you have not screwed up crossing the bridge, If you cross again, it collapses. So better make damn sure you got everything. Um, that's not intimidating at all. What do I give it? Apparently I have fooled the goal.
Man, Roberta loves her rickety stair puzzles. We just took the hickory smoke time.
That was easy. Almost done the game.
saving its life for the one who caught it in the first place. Yet in another spiral staircase, that like three in this game, And like a lion, not go in the lion.
Oh, we don't have anything else to do. Where did he get the taxter? He didn't arrive there with it. Good night, Meowsy. So if I missed 11 points. Didn't get the bottle, the cloth from the bottle. Or use the cloth from the birdcage. Got only eight points. There must be three points I missed somewhere else. Hey, whatever. Be right back, and we will do the third game. And the third game is actually kind of tedious for one thing. <laughs> 